You will drown in eternal night. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel and to another Mortal Kombat mobile video. Today we are going into Faction Wars and I will show you one way how to make Classic Jax pretty much a god. Now let's have a quick look at the gear I'm using on my team. You know the team already, I've played it in the video, Cripple Triple, and basically here nothing changed, but now we are putting the Spectre's Burning Vengeance and the Divine Argus Cloak on Classic Jax to kind of amplify his passive, which means that every time when the opponent tries to hit you there is a chance that they will start burning. If they break your block they are supposed to get a negative effect plus the passive that Classic Jax already has, including the Steel Curtain and all that stuff. Now let's just jump here into the first fight and let's have a quick look how that will go down. Here we start with the combo ender by Jax and let's block here. Okay, that blind and burn was already applied before. Now here we already have Raiden burning as you can see. The effects are not very long lasting, but therefore we will just uh, throw plenty of them at them. And here, Terminator already saved me. Let's just get rid of Dark Raiden this way. Special too. And Raiden is out. Now we just go back to Jax and block some more. Let's see. Combo ender by Jax. And here we have another burn effect. Once again, the Terminator is there to save the day. Okay, maybe not the best team to try this one on, but we will probably have some more interesting teams to come in future battles. We have five to go in general, so we still have four to see how the stuff works. Impressive. And let's get here into the next battle. We already have the Blind Blazes Life Force will now add the burn. And we have a Frostbite as well. Beautiful. Oh, by the way, I'm using also the Deadly Icicles here on Jax, which means that I have 100% chance to apply Frostbite. Oh, here we already a uh, added a few debuffs here to Johnny. Yeah, but yeah, we get Frostbite by 100% on special to use, just in case they survive, which is very unlikely unless they get a shield up or something like that. Okay, now Power Drain and Burn is not the greatest on Dark Raiden either here. Let's see. Here we get rid of him and that special two will just take out Johnny. Johnny is pretty much done for anyway. Moving on. That was for your own good. One of the main problems here is now at the moment the fusion boost which is kind of a little bit buggy so we are not getting really strong opponents. I really hope they fix that with the next update because then we can make stuff like that even better. But here you saw I applied blind and slow and now we just retaliated. Here we have poison and fire. Poor Kung Lao, he's getting it from every side here now and the special two basically taking him out and now the Terminator saves. 
Jax, even though he didn't need saving. But we all know this stuff the Terminator does. And here this Mournful Kitana was again so weak, it's really pointless with this fusion boost at the moment. But now let's move on to the next fight. Here we have Flaming Fist Liu Kang. Okay. Everything here is going good. And now the attack to the Terminator. Just to make sure that he will get tagged out by Sonya Blade. Because he could still come back and interrupt and save people. But I don't want my Jax to get tagged out or something. Unfortunately, now here we have Treacherous Panya. Stay down. Could you please give me that Sonya Blade and time out my Terminator? Stay down. Let's use a special tool. Okay. And Tanya is out, and now here the Terminator will be timed out. Ah, damn. Now we have Aaron Black, also one that we didn't need. Maybe let's just block this one and then get to Classic Jacks. Yeah, exactly. Here we have Weekend in between. He just broke our block, so the Divine Argus Cloak works here. That was the fire from Spectre's Burning Vengeance. Here we have Cripple from his passive. And the special two to take him out. This is going way too fast here, but you guys get the idea. Outstanding. Let's try again and hope for some more formidable foes. Fight. Directly the attack to Jax. At least Jason can take some damage here. Okay. Combo ender by Jax and Jason is almost down. Now he's crippled and burning. So Spectre is burning vengeance. Did a good job. Here we have the power drain from the passive. And now special two just taking out Leatherface. Let's block Freddy again. And here we have the Terminator. Alright, special two. That should take out Freddy. Not the best run. But at least we applied a few of those effects. And when it just comes to winning, I mean you see this team just does what it's supposed to do. Outstanding. And with that, the video already ends. I pretty much showed you what I wanted to show, even though I wish I could have showed you way more, aka stronger teams, so that more effects could be applied. On the other hand, my Jax is not really maxed out or far from it, I think he's somewhere at Fusion 5 or something, I don't, don't even look at that, he's either maxed out or he's not, but yeah, as um, soon as Jax will get stronger and maybe the Fusion Boost gets fixed, we might get a few more other interesting gear pieces we can... Ca we might get even more funny gear to put on him. If you just want to reflect damage, then you still can go for his own gear and a combination with the bloody Shokan armor, for example. But if it's just applying effects, then here the Divine Argus Cloak and Spectre's Burning Vengeance is a pretty interesting way to go. 
Thank you for tuning in once again. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. In case you didn't like the video, hit the dislike button twice just to make sure. And if you want to support the channel a little further, please consider joining the Patreon family of KC Mobile Gaming. You can already do that with as little as just $1 a month. And also follow me on social media like Twitter and Facebook. You will find all the necessary information in the description below of every video. If you want to see more content, then why don't you just click on one of those two videos here. Thank you for your support. Have a good one. Casey over and out for today.